Hey, what's going on, everyone? Thanks for joining me tonight here at YT Sports Break. This is September 27, 2020, 7.15 p.m. This is 2020 Bowman Mega Box number three, 20 box break. I want to thank everyone again for joining me tonight. Uh, without further ado, we'll go ahead and start breaking. We'll do four boxes at a time. As you guys can see, there's three rows in the back of fours and two rows in the front of fours. So total of five rows, uh, four boxes each. So 20 boxes, and we'll get started. Four, four boxes. Everything do ship out of this product. So good luck, guys. I've done three of these, so probably a total of, I want to say, about maybe 80 boxes of this. And I have not pulled uh, an auto for two of the top guys, which is Bobby Witt and Jason Dominguez. So, let's see if we can do it tonight. Are you guys interested in 20, uh, 2020 Bowman Chrome? They're just a little bit over out of out of price right now. So I remember when those things were only 125. boxes let's go yeah Nick it's it's super overpriced like they started out what they're around 220s 225 220s and I was like wow man when these things were only like 125 bucks man it's just ridiculous they just overpriced it Who's the big chase? Acuna, Acuna's younger brother. Uh, Laura. Who else was in that one? I think there was a, a few other names that I'm missing. Can't think of it off the top. Yeah. That's what it seems like. You know, can Bowman draft, you know, not a lot of the good players were in that one. They wait until uh, Bowman to bring out some of the better ones. So, you know, they're really, really looking, digging very deep for the for these prospects now. All right guys, we'll get started with the regular packs first and then we'll open up the mega boxes afterwards. And once again, everything do ship out of here. Okay, Marquez, Jesus Sanchez, Mike Trout, <clears throat> Nico Huzler, Wolfer uh, Astendilo. He's his older brother is on the twins, right? These are some pretty nice looking cards though. I give it props. Stevon Florio, Louis Robert, J. 
Chaz Chisholm to end the playoffs, so that's cool. <laughs> yeah, true. Nolan Gorbin, paper. I wonder when he's going to get some playing time. Miguel Amaya. Josh Jung. Tyber Ruiz. Devin Carlson. All back, Sicto Sanchez. That's one of the. I don't like this photo. One of the worst ones. Jordan Groshaw, Blake Rutherford. Daniel Lynch, Ronaldo Hernandez. Need a wonder Franco upside down. Carnacion, Aaron Ashby, Jerry Killing it. Allie Shortridge, Brendan Davis. Don't know why all those crumbs are upside down. Ian Anderson, Carnacion, so nothing really there. Not one Poisson, not one Dominguez, not one Newit. So hopefully we'll have a have some better luck with these Mega Box packs. I love these mega box uh, exclusive. I love the mojo look. <clears throat> I know a lot of people don't like them, but I, I'm really, really turned on by these mojo looks. Back in 2017, when I was chasing Shohei Otani when he was still in his Japanese uh, jersey, I opened up, I want to say like 50 boxes of that for myself and pulled one Otani. But I remember just, just the refract. Just the mojo alone was a super nice one. And, you know, with the design, all of these will get sleeve. Andrew Vaughn, Open Cardenas, Louis Robert, Xavier Howard. We get our first autograph. Or the Yankees. Is it who we think it is? No, it's not. Dang it. It is TJ Sakima. Wrong Yankee. TJ Sakima. That's our first auto. Encarnacion. Uh, we get a purple of Aaron Savale. That is to 250. 181 out of 250. Aaron Savale. 
We get a Luis Garcia to 250. This is 140 out of 250 for the Nationals. Back to back purple. <clears throat> Van Levine. Wow. Van Levine. Nate Pearson. Oh, we get a pink. It's, a, it's not a first. Alec Thomas for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Oh, why did I not forget to put up the list? Sorry, guys. So nobody took the Arizona Diamondbacks, so the guy in order to cancel. Why did I put it up? Sorry, guys, for the list. So that is out of 199. Just noticed that. Hey, sorry guys. <clears throat> Christian Potts, Colt Walker, Louis Robert, Philip Ramos, Jack Chisholm, Terry Trammell, and Abram Toro. So nothing too crazy. Sure, Nick. Uh, sure, I could do that. You could send it to PayPal to... Uh, let me type it up here. Give me one second. Sorry, guys. I'm going to pause it here real quick. I got to pull up my mouse or my thing. Continue. Just let me know in the uh, in the notes, in the PayPal notes, uh, what your name is, and I'll I'll make sure to to send it with your package. Thank you. I had zero reviews, zero rating, and bought it, and I was like, you know what, got to start from somewhere, So, but he ended up canceling, so ended up adding him to the block list. Just let me know who you are and I'll update the Excel file.
Come on, come on. Those first four boxes was not that good. We got some nice color. But no big guys yet. Good luck. Box 8, Ethan Hankins. <clears throat> Nick Madrigal. Bryce Terrain. Bobby Witt paper. First paper of one of the bigger ones. Joe Dell. Alec Thomas, Miguel Vargas. Now that bat drop. Same photo on Topps Chrome, I believe. Laura. This is the guy who's everyone's chasing in Bowman Chrome. <clears throat> he doesn't have an autograph in this set here. <clears throat> Only Chrome and paper. And but he gets a first autograph in Bowman Chrome. Jason Dominguez. Base. That means that Bobby Witt is lurking somewhere here. Unless that's the Moga mega box um, mega box ones usually when you see him you see a Bobby Witt but that could just be in the mega box packs so the lucky one okay thanks a lot let me update this Appreciate it, Nick. All right, we'll go ahead and just keep moving forward. I'll check the I'll check it later, but I trust you. Poisson for Oakland. John Diaz, Tony Gosling, Bobby Whip Paper, Cruz, Bo, Colton Walker, this guy's been a prospect forever. On to the Mega Box pack.
Zach Brown, start us up. Garcia. Juan Lefranco. Bo Bichette. Poisson. Mojo. Elias Rushman. Screwball. We get another autograph. This time. It's Pittsburgh. Had to be Aaron Ashby. That seems to be all all in here. Him and that short ridge guy. Or no, wait. That's Milwaukee. Aaron Ashby. Autograph. Congrats. We get another Poisson. And the Adios Rushman. Casey Mize. Julio Rodriguez. Scubo. Sean Murphy. Gunnar Henderson. Underrated guy, Gunnar Henderson. Heard good things about him. We get a pink. Andre Nunez for the Padres. Spanning the globe. That is 30 out of 199. Let's see it there. It's 30 out of 199. Jordan Alvarez. Maya. And a Bobby Witt. Okay. Some decent, some pretty decent ones in those mega packs. All right, let's keep it going. <clears throat> so in our last break, right before this one, the over and under for autographs were four and a half. We hit five. Over and under for autographs out of here, I say we'll be over four and a half. So we we'll need five autographs in here. know if the price has come down for the Jason Dominguez guy remember his base crones were selling for like 80 bucks each and I was like wow it should be hovering around like 30 bucks right should be no more than that
<clears throat> Thanks, Nick. Yeah, I figure, you know, for one of the top prospect out of this product right here, 30 bucks is already high enough, you know. Should be hovering around like, I wonder if Franco was hovering around like 10 bucks and I bought a few of them. My buddy was like, man, you're paying 10 bucks for a base card. I was like, yeah, they're pretty decent. You know, that's where the Jason Dominguez should be at, 10 bucks for a base card. I remember when it first came out, I was like 80 bucks, 100, sometimes 100 bucks. It was like, yeah, way outpriced my range. So, couldn't make it into a into a set. Justin Dunn to start us off. We get Poisson, base paper. Luis Castillo, ace for the Reds, that's what I heard. So, a lot of people are telling me that they got three ace on that team. Another Poisson, base paper. Okay. Yeah, it seems like that's where he should be hovering around. 80 bucks was kind of ridiculous when it first came out. I get he is 17 years old and, you know, he does have some talent there. And youth is on his side, so. Yeah, that's right. We hit a Brady Singer red on break number two, or break number two, we hit a Brady Singer red. That's right. We hit a red refractor. I heard good things about him. One guy said that he was a top prospect for the Rangers uh, organization, so never heard anything about him until he told me. Poisson base for the Oaklands. That's three so far from just these four boxes. So What is he hovering at? I remember looking at him like two months ago. He was hovering at about maybe $2 per base card. My guess is if if it's like he said and he's hot right now, then he should be around like maybe 10 bucks for a base chrome. But you got to you got to remember that if you're buying off of eBay, you got to factor the shipping cost, which is most of the time is 4 bucks. I spent 15 bucks for that card right there. <laughs> okay. Let's see if we could get one of them here so I can read the back. Joe Ryan. Screwball. Yu Chang. Yeah. 
Alec Baum. I like that guy, Alec Baum. C.J. Abrams. We get a blue. Christian Posh. For the Braves. Okay. That is 28 out of 150. Christian Posh. All right, I think this is our first four box with no autographs. And no autographs out of there. I think so. I think he has a nice swing. Very nice swing. So I like that guy a lot. Play very play pretty good for the Phillies. But man, that Philly team. A lot of talent. It just can't go anywhere. Kinda like the Angels. But they got better pitching than the Angels, that's for sure. And you have Andrew Heaney as your first pitcher. Yeah. You're not going places. Yeah, you know, just poorly run teams. <clears throat> when I saw him played in the... Uh, the all-star game I saw that swing and I was like wow this guy he's big he's tall he has a nice swing for how big he is and he just looks like he's opposing when he steps up he's like oh wow I see that's the reason why they're not doing good then Nice to see him get in. It would have been nice to see the Phillies get in and see if they, with that roster, if they could have done something. Yeah, I believe it was uh, the last spot went to Milwaukee. Some of the guys from the previous one was telling me about that. It's good to see him in Milwaukee now. Phillies will have to be next year. <clears throat> Need to get some help if they play a hundred. If we play a full season too. So, I thought for sure the Angels would get in there because it's a 60-game season and they tend to get out hot at the early beginning and then kind of fade off towards the end. But, you know, they just never got it going. <clears throat> yeah, man, the offense is really good. Touching. Harper, Sint, who is this? Hoskins. 
State has a lot of a lot of players, big like name players too. It's like it's probably why they say you can't build build a team with name players. You got to have some people who are willing to get down and dirty and do all the dirty work for you for your team. Hunter Green. <clears throat> well, he wants to pitch. I think I think he's going to try. But if he gets another setback, I think they're just going to they're he's going to have to go play first base. He's going to go have to learn how to play another another position if he wants to stay on the field. Being a DH, what is it? Going to play like what? 80, 80, maybe 60 games a season, you know, come in and pinch hit. It's all he could really provide for his team. So, yeah, it was sad to see him get injured so quick, too. Dominguez. He just had a bad year. He, he, I don't know what, what it was. Guy, guy could barely hit this year, too. So, probably wet paper. <clears throat> But the Angels, they're, they're just badly run. Mike Trout could have chose to go somewhere else and, and be a part of the winning franchise, right? Decides to sign a $400 million contract with the Angels to stay on a losing team that gets some help with Anthony Rendon. But when you can't, when you can't pitch, when you can't pitch, you're, you're not going to win. <clears throat> it's just the name of the game. Both those guys could be 350 hitters, hit 30 home runs, but you know if the team gives up, uh, the team gives up a lot of runs too. You know, just nothing you could really, nothing you could really do. So yeah, they got a lot of work that they need to do. But I'm also a. Uh, it's crazy that I'm also a Oakland fan, so I pretty much out. You know, as long as it's a good playoff and a good World Series, that's all that really matters. It'd be nice to see the Oakland win win one. Yep, I think it's um. I think his deal might be coming up soon. What, did he sign a three-year contract or was it a five-year contract? My guess it was a three-year. So this is 2021 should be his last year and then see if he wants to re-sign. But, you know, he could go cross freeways to the Dodgers. They definitely, if he went to the Dodgers, oh my. Yeah, thought so too, man. Everyone did. Okay, Brian Hayes to start us off. We get a pink. Ethan Hankins for the Indians. I love these pink parallels. Out of 199. I like how they added these pink parallels. Heard this guy's a stud. Ryan McCastle, Kyle Lewis, Let's 
slow. We're turning towards the under. Oh, we get a gold. It's not a first, but it's for Jesus Sanchez for the Miami Marlins gold to 50. That is two out of 50. Meaning there's only one right before this one. Two out of 50. Jesus Sanchez for Miami Marlins. We get a Poisson. Andrew Vaughn, Cardenas, Jeremy Lux. Okay, and that does it for that one. You know, uh, they should, they, they, they're good in the regular season. Come postseason, you know, yeah, man. They do have a young team, so. Pretty decent ring now. Who's your team, Nick? That's on the World Series winner. Got the Dodgers. Just like everyone else. But I like the Cubs. The Cubs, for some reason, I like them. That's my underdog. They're not really underdog, but that's my that's my team that I think that can or could take off the Dodgers. But yeah. I want to see. I just want to see Kershaw do good in the playoffs. That guy giving up the homer to Rendon last year. Oh, that was tough. Oh, you're a Cards fan. Okay. You guys, who are you guys playing? The Padres, that's right. You guys are playing the Padres, so... A lot of people are saying that you guys are going to get beat by the Padres 2-0. You guys think you guys have a shot against the Padres and that potent offense and that decently good pitching squad that they got going on over there. Maybe the NL Rookie of the Year and Christian, Manny Machado. Is Dylan Carlson playing for you guys? Or did he get relegated back? Is, it, is he on the postseason roster? Padres could could make a run for it too, you know. If they start showing up and not not be the Padres. So 
Oh, um, yeah, man. It, it was a crazy season. The shortened season, you know, it was just crazy. You know, the one thing that, um, <clears throat> that I watch is historical, right? You guys are... You guys are always beating the Giants. Or no, wait, you guys are always beating the Dodgers, so Dodgers don't want to see you guys. And the Dodgers don't want to see the Giants, so that was good that they they didn't make it in. But the Dodgers just looked like the team to beat. Okay. And everyone's talking big about that guy. Big, big before the season started. Kyle Mitchell. Tim K. Here he is. You guys are sneaky. You guys just know how to play baseball. That's... Cardinals just know how to play baseball. That's pretty much it. You guys just out... You guys just out... Play the... Out coach the other team. Out play the other team. You know, just outsmart the other team. Maybe all the physical attributes and all the other stuff is not there, but you guys just know how to play the game and just how to beat the other team at that. Back when, you know, when you guys played the Texas Rangers, when they had their big lineup, big squad, and you guys took them out, I was like, wow. Look at this coaching here. But, you know, with the new rule of uh, having to pitch, having to pitch at least three batters before you can be taken out, I think that's going to have a big effect, you know. Not a lot of people was talking about it, but yeah, it's true. Good luck, guys. This is the end of the mega packs that we're all been waiting for. So let's hopefully we could get some fire out of these guys here. Hasn't been the best 20 boxes, you know. But hopefully we can end it off strong here. Glenn Allen Hill Jr. Pink for the D-backs. There you go, Nick. That is 68 out of 199. Got a few color in this one, so that's that's good. Joel Ryan, we get a Dominguez. Spanning the globe. Right behind that, we get a Bobby Witt Jr. Right behind that, we get a Jason Dominguez. 
nice nice and we get a Adbert Azale <clears throat> excuse me purple refractor for the Cubbies that is 215 out of 250 Poisson, Xavier Howard, and for the White Sox, Green Refractor <clears throat> to 99. That is 84 out of 99. Nick Madrigal for the White Sox. And to finish it off, we get. Bobby Witt and a Jason Dominguez. Nice to finish it off. All right, you know, they came up at the very, very end there, so. We'll do a hit recap here. So let me sleeve up these guys really quick for you guys. Those four boxes were probably the best four boxes out of the entire four boxes <clears throat> or 20 boxes those four boxes right there of hitting the big top prospects hi guys Sorry, Tim. I think Trevor. My guess is these Bobby Witt uh, mojos are going for about maybe 20 bucks. That's my guess. So I'm just going to quickly roam through this for these guys. The top four prospects in this set here. Paper. Mojo and Chrome. It did off pretty strong there. Color Nick Madrigal to ninety nine. Ab Aber adds away to two fifty. Glenn Glenn Allen, Allen Hill Junior. <clears throat> To 199. Uh, yeah, I would say so. Maybe a little bit more. 50. Jesus Sanchez, Ethan Hackins, Pink to 199. Andre Munoz to 199 for the Padres. Alec Thomas to 199 for D backs. Luis Garcia to 250 for the Nationals. We get Aaron Savale for the Cleveland Indians to 250. And with Christian Potch to 150 for the Atlanta Braves. And for our two autographs, we get Aaron Ashby for Milwaukee Brewers base auto. And we get TJ Sakima for the Yankees base autograph. All right, thanks guys. Thanks for joining me for break for 2020 Bowman. 20 box break number three. You guys have a good night.